recent interview with Steve Espinoza, he is very confident that the Terrence Crawford versus Zero Spence fight will take place really soon. It is coming. That is from Steven Espinoza. He's saying pretty much uh, from what from what he's saying, it's like they got over uh, most of the major hurdles, but they have some things to iron out. And he, he even uh, says, if you look at Errol Spence, when he's asked about the fight as well, he always is always more certain. He puts on smiles and stuff like that. So I want to get you guys' opinion. Uh, on what Steven Espinosa is saying. He's saying it's, it's, uh, it's a few things left to iron out. See, this is what I mean about uh, we, we always hear different stuff. We're hearing Steve Espinosa say that, but then you're hearing uh, Bud's people say something totally different. So it's like, this is unheard of, though, man. Like, you know, I, I this, you know, this thing that's happening with this fight. All it's showing is that that is just how big this damn thing is, bro. It's how big this damn thing is, man. Let me tell you something, man. All of the shit that people are going through on on this YouTube boxing community over this fight, all the back and forth, all of the supporting Bud, the supporting Arrow, this, that, and the third, that fight better be motherfucking bomb, man. That fight better be the shit. It better be no first round knockouts. It better be no headbutts with stoppages from headbutts. I don't want to see none of that shit. I want to see this motherfucker shit go the distance. Or I want to see a, 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 a nice knockout towards the end of the fight or something like that. You know, but this is this is what we wait for. This is why we love the sport. You know, I know a lot of times it, it seems like uh, people from... That support Arrow and that support Bud. It might seem like we support just boxer, uh, a certain boxer, but I think it's both, man. Besides the uh, the extreme fanboys and shit like that, I think it's for the most part. I think it's both. I think people love the sport and they have some and they love and they support both of these dudes. So uh, you know, it just has a lot of emotions that tied up in it, man, because. Like I said, this is a man's sport, bro. And man, we very competitive, and we like to see competition, and we like to see uh, these these kind of things on, uh, take place. These these great the greatness, you know, greatness for them, and especially people that are from where these boxers is from. You know, it, it, it's good for them because it it makes them feel like they're part of something. You know, what I mean, um, people from Omaha they're rooting for Terrence Crawford, and people from Dallas. They're rooting for Errol Spence. Uh, this is big for them. You know, it's, it's, it's big for them more than it is for us. Because if the people from Dallas, they get Errol Spence to win, become undisputed to them, that's big because this is like the equivalent of, um, you know, Dallas Cowboys winning the Super Bowl, you know, or something like that. I'm not sure if baseball have a, if Dallas has a baseball team. I don't think so, right? I don't think so. Not accused with the closest what Houston Astros or something like that. But yeah, you know you got all the Dallas Mavericks winning the uh, the NBA the the um the finals and all that stuff like that, the championship game, you know, or Omaha, you know, Nebraska. I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure what's out there. You know, what teams and stuff out there. I don't think Omaha even has a. Uh, I don't think Nebraska even has a a, a basketball. Or a football team like that. You know they got college football and all that stuff, but y'all know what I mean. It's it's a it's a sense of belonging, and that is what this is really about, man. At the end of the day, like I said in my live, you know, it's no real beef with none of these cats up here on YouTube. This is strictly YouTube uh, back and forth with me. You know what I mean? And uh, it just the the problem is a lot of dudes getting their feelings because somebody's talking about their favorite fighter. That's when a lot of, that's, that causes a lot of rifts. Like, yo, how are you going to tell another person that not to talk about, how, how to talk about somebody that you like? You know what I mean? And like I, I say it again, I see comments about Terrence Crawford all the time. You know what I mean? I don't sit up there getting all pissed off and, yo, you know what? Hey, 
Yo, you feel like that? Yo, won't you come over here on my on my shit, and, and we could debate if you feel like that about Bud. Like, huh? Like, uh, no, no. It's that, yeah, that's your opinion. You're entitled to it, just like I'm entitled to mine. Respect it. It's that simple. Rather you think it's not true, or rather you think it is. Respect it. That's all, man. But this is what Steven Espinosa is saying that the fight between Errol Spence and Terrence Crawford is close to being finalized, so he says. But then there's that thing again, like I just said, that Team Bud is saying, hey, they're trying to put the squeeze on us, bro. You know, could that mean money? Could that mean venue? Could that mean both? Could that mean other stuff? We don't know because these dudes are keeping things pretty tight, man. And that's cool. That's cool, you know, because... Uh, it's cool in a sense, you, you know, you, you don't want everything blurted out all over the social media before anything gets done, but, you know, it's nice to have a little, you know, a little, a little morsel of an update once in a while, like, hey, what's up, y'all, this is Bud, or this is Arrow. yeah, we making, you know, we making progress with this fight, you know, we, we, we almost there, like, you know, that's how big this shit is for people, man, at least say something like that, you know, keep, the, don't keep us, like, completely in the dark, you know what I mean, just turn the light on a little bit, dim it, you know, but that's all I got, man, hey, this is Rebel Life Boxing, let me know what you think, like, subscribe, I'll catch y'all on the next one, and I'm out, peace.